Oh, that was pure luck. I'll check it out. Grab your stuffies. Welcome back to the channel. We're playing Resident Evil Zero today. Let's dive on in. Resident Evil Zero. A Midwestern town in America, Raccoon City, a solitary island far off in the sea, Rockfort Island, an island that would become the second Raccoon City, Sheena Island. There are still many unanswered questions about these seemingly unrelated yet intensely traumatic events. Though it is believed that the International Enterprise umbrella was somehow involved, Little is known as to the origin of this faceless corporation. When was it established? By whom? And how was the T-Virus created? To uncover the truth, we must delve deeper into the events which transpired in the beginning, before the mansion incident. Do you think so too? Yeah. Do about it. Hold off for a while. I wonder how those are in people react to this. began as a simple investigation of some bizarre murders in the suburbs of Raccoon City. Nothing in our training could ever have prepared us for the nightmare that ensued. We never stood a chance. What's going on? Engine failure! Emergency landing! Rebecca's so cute. Check the current position <clears throat> and investigate the surrounding area. Captain, look! <gasps> Captain! Hmm? What happened? Order for transportation. Prisoner Billy Cohen, ex lieutenant, 26 years old. Court martialed and sentenced to death July 22nd. Prisoner is to be transferred to the Regathon base for execution. Those poor soldiers. They were good men just doing their jobs, and that scum murdered them and escaped. All right, everyone, let's separate and survey the area. Our friend is brutal and ruthless. Keep your guard up.
The door to safety is shut. There is no turning back. Okay, so let's see what we got. All right. <clears throat> All right. I think we are ready to go. I gotta remember the controls on this one now. This one's got a lot more controls to deal with. With the switching back and forth and... This is Officer Chambers from Stars Bravo Team. Please identify yourself. Is someone there? The Used to the other controls. Used to the other controls. Okay, we got it. <clears throat> Check all these rooms. The door, uh, door. Wow, there doesn't seem to be anything of use. <clears throat> oh, handgun ammo. I will take that, thank you. This poor guy must have been attacked in his sleep. His body is covered in slime. Passenger's Diary, July 14th. Orders came from the boss today. Looks like we're in charge of investigating the remains of the Arclay Mountains Laboratory. We're moving in two groups. The initial group is assigned to start checking what's left of the abandoned experiment. 16th. Unfortunately, the test production of BOW Type Y139 had to be suspended because of this investigation. It's the same, it's the same with Type 139. There's still so much we don't know about the responses to the crustacean T-virus. There's a lot of interesting research left. Depending on the species and nurturing condition, only minute, only minute doses of T bring about remarkable changes in solidity, size, multiplication of internal toxins, and brain development. If these, ex if these effects can be controlled, a powerful weapon could be produced. But the sudden development of the shell results in a corresponding fragility. Certain areas become exceedingly weak. Problematically, one of these areas is head is the head carapace. This lab we are going to this lab we are going to were they were they pursuing the same research? It would certainly help to find data and samples that would help us in our research. Nineteenth June. The day is finally approaching. I am growing more anxious. The Raccoon City newspapers and TV stations are full of reports about the bizarre murders in the suburbs. It can't be the virus, can it? If it is... No, I can't think of that now. I have a, to concentrate on this investigation and make sure it goes smoothly. Mm-hmm. Okay. I don't think there was anything else in there. Let's check this room. Room 201. It's a save room. Okay, so we're gonna examine this, but not take it. We'll take the herb, though. Another, uh, passage. Investigation orders. Stained with blood, some sections are Ill Ill illegible. Wow. Eight miles north of Raccoon City in the Arclay Mountains lies our comp, New York's management training facility. NY's management training? I don't know. It was shut down years ago. Now we are conducting a pre preliminary, preliminary study into the reopening of the facilities. Investigation unit is already on site and opening the investigation. I want your team to provide support. The following orders are William, probably William, are William Birkin, maybe? Will Embark, oh, Will Embark, okay, Will Embark, the following orders are Will Embark and, 
I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm wasting too much time on that. Alright, whatever. So there were people on this train to investigate everything. Going to investigate this lab, and then that guy with the leeches <clears throat> stopped the train so that they wouldn't do that. That's what it seems like. Billy. Lieutenant Cohen. So, you seem to know me. Been fantasizing about me, have you? You're the prisoner that was being transferred for execution. You were with those soldiers outside. Oh, I see. You're with stars. Well, no offense, honey, but your kind doesn't seem to want me around. So, I'm afraid our little chat time is over. Wait! You're under arrest! No thanks, Dollface. I've already worn handcuffs. I could shoot, you know. Edward! Are you alright? What happened? It's worse than... We can't... You must be careful, Rebecca. is full of z zombies and monsters. Zombies and monsters? We already saw the zombies. Uh, uh. <laughs> Alright. Bring it on. Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Ew, you can see its stomach. Look at that, right there, you can see its stomach. Nasty. Oh, oh whatever, I shot him. Oh! <laughs> I jumped at that one. We were so happy just a few hours ago. He's holding something. You holding any more? The body has bite marks all over it. That poor guy. Nope, nope, nope. Alright. Making progress. Just run. No! Ah, da 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 no! Back off! Back off. This is Rebecca. Over. Enrico! Hello! Can you read me? Please respond. Rebecca, I can hear you. Now listen up. We've obtained detailed information on the fugitive from a document found in the wrecked wagon. Billy Cullen killed as many as 23 people. Over. 23 people? We have also confirmed that he was institutionalized, so keep your guard up. Can you hear me, Rebecca? Over. Stay alert, Rebecca. He wouldn't think twice before killing you. Enrico! Captain! Hello? Hello! Luggage lies strewn about the cabin. The seats are stained with red with blood. Stained red with blood. Dude! I am not interested. Not interested. Did you it's kill- It's gonna be dangerous from here on in. Those zombies for Why me? Why don't we cooperate? 
Cooperate with you? Listen, little girl, if you haven't noticed, there's some pretty freaked out things on this train. And I, for one, want to get out of here. I don't think we stand a chance doing it alone. You expect me to trust you, a wanted felon? I don't need your help. I can handle this on my own. And don't call me little girl. All right, Miss Do-It-Yourself. What should I call you? The name is Rebecca Chambers, but that's Officer Chambers to you. <clears throat> well then, Rebecca, why don't you go and try while I wait here? Fine. I will. When closing the dining car, supervisors are asked to switch off the automatic doors after ensuring all staff have evacuated the car. The main automatic door power switch is located on the roof of the fifth car. Inspections will take place when the train is garaged. After inspections are complete, use the ladder at the rear of the second floor of the dining car. Umbrella Corporation Maintenance Department. Oh, it's the Umbrella Corporation. Wow. Okay. <clears throat> Interesting. Counters that are with slips of paper listings, customers orders. <clears throat> There's an old man. Um excuse me, sir. Sir. Turn around, run away. <clears throat> no way. that guy oh. creepy what's going on who's controlling the train go and check out the first engine car listen we've got to cooperate with each other from now on you got that well i don't clue in girl or maybe you like being worm bait all right but you just remember i will shoot you if you try anything funny fine now take these with you. If you find anything, give me a call, all right? <clears throat> all right, so. Oh, player's manual, figure it out. I think it's triangle and then it's R1. Yeah, I should have read it after all. Let's split up. Okay. Oh, R2. This R2 one. and triangle. Okay. I'll go alone. Roger. Nope. This way. Roger. Wrong button. Wrong button. Gotta figure out how to open the menu. Square. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna do that. I'll go check over there. Yeah. Because Billy is much stronger. And his handgun is better.
I'd be terrified to do that. I feel like I would fly off the train. Yay! Take those. Place that in there. Man, she's already on orange. <laughs> That's another thing about Rebecca, is her health is so low compared to Billy's. So. It's better to just do most of the fighting with Billy. Over here, nope. All right, we got a train key. <clears throat> yeah, okay, remember where to use it. I think it's back where uh, Edward was. Is that what his name was? Are you even shooting anybody? I don't think you were. I think I just wasted all that ammo. Oh shit. Crap. Get off me. Woo! More zombies in there than I was expecting. And I wasted a bunch of bullets. Okay, just shoot him. <laughs> Ammo's easier to come by than health is, so... Okay, they're all done. Let's uh, reload my weapon. <clears throat> yes, throw that away. I will take the map. Thank you. So if you examine items and then just exit out, um, they will uh, be outside the train later. The key card for driver's compartment is in my bag as always, but I need the other guy's key to open the damn thing. But it looks like I've lost it somewhere. It was a normal key, someone would have would be sure to turn it in, but this key is different. I'll look for it too, but if you happen to find it, please hand it in. Thanks in advance. Okay, we'll need that eventually, but I'm not gonna take it yet. There's more important things to get right now.
Wonder what that could have been. We will need this, though. Yes, the ice pick. Nasty leeches over there. Take those. I am not gonna take these. Not gonna take that. Take that. And I'm not gonna take these in either. Is this open? No. Let's see if I can get this to work. You can just use the knife, seriously. But I used the shotgun first, because I'm just gonna leave the shotgun here, because it's a crappy shotgun. So there's no reason to use it any further. So, I just figured I'll use those two bullets in it, and then I'm gonna get rid of it. This is so funny. You just like basically stun locked him and he can't do anything. Takes a little bit, but I'm not getting hit. Oh shit, I forgot about that. I forgot. After you kill him, he does swing his hands around, and he will hit you. Which he did. I shouldn't say hands, his claws. But I'm still fine, so. And we can actually just leave this now. But I'm not gonna leave it by the door, because otherwise I'm not gonna be able to get in the door. It's gonna examine the freaking gun every time. Alright. What does that say? Welcome to the Ecliptic Salon. Please join us for a moment of relaxation. Um, I think I got everything out of there. So, I think we're good. You know what? I'm gonna grab the shotgun shells, just in case. Because I know each room can only hurt a certain amount of items, and the last thing I want to do is leave those shotgun shells. So, we're gonna grab those. Just as a precaution. Alright. It's weird that there's a key shape underneath the keyhole on the door. What would be its purpose? That one doesn't have one, though. Climb down the ladder, the ladder of death, 
in the train of death. Get that stuff later on our way back. See, look, there's a key shape underneath the keyhole. Why? That's such a weird design. Weird, weird, weird. You're probably wondering also why I dropped the hunter gun. You don't get- you get the shotgun, uh, fairly quickly, so... Like, after the train, so... There's no reason to keep the hunting gun anymore. At least in my opinion, I don't find any good use for it. Alright, can you guys just stay dead now? That would be nice. Yeah, that's right. Actually, I don't think... I don't think I need that anymore either. So that can go... Sorry, I'm playing with the, like, new controls. I've only done that once, and I think I eventually turned them off, and if I can, I might be doing the same thing. We'll see. Because there's some parts about it that can be helpful, and then there's some parts about it that are really infuriating. <laughs> There's something stuck in the keyhole. It's preventing the doorknob from turning. The first time I played this game in hard mode, uh, I decided to go for the do it under three hour, three and a half hours run. And I kid you not, I beat the game in three hours, 29 minutes, and 59 seconds. And I have the screenshot to prove it because that was just so crazy. I almost didn't do it. But, it was pretty awesome. It was pretty awesome, not gonna lie. Follow me! Yeah. <sighs> yes, I would like to enter the crawl space, please. Okay, he's stun locked me. What the hell? Alright, let's grab these shotgun shells. See, Billy is still doing just fine. That is why Billy is the person to use. Hold on, let's combine that with that, and I will exchange that for those. And I will give this to him. Okay. There's a reason for my madness, I promise. We have to get the hook shot. Oh, 
Hookshot Operator's Manual. The device should only be used when inspecting difficult to access part roofs when connecting special trains return to the proper location for use. Where to use, there's a ladder outside, the small window in the first toilet section, the third carriage, carriage. Fire the device so that it looks high into the ladder. You guys get this. I need to read that. All right, now we gotta go back to that window and use the hook shot. The door is now unlocked. Here we go, going back in the kitchen. I have to say, the shooting in this is much slower. Like the aiming, the auto aim and stuff is a lot slower than all the other previous titles. That's okay. Well, Billy can keep that for now. But if I'm not mistaken, I believe that if you give. Rebecca, the Molotov cocktail, she can actually throw them quicker than Billy can. So they're always good to have on her, um, for when you run into, like, the leech monsters and stuff. So. Alright, we're good. Come on, Billy. Come on, Billy. We're good. Yes, it is of use now, because I have the hook shot, okay? I have the hook shot. Excuse me. Oh, wow, he is cute. Look at his nasty teeth. Oh, shit, 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 shit. It's not what I wanted to do at all. It won't open. There's something in the way. Wow, that's, uh, that's pretty crazy. I just had enough ammo for that. You know what? Screw it. I don't care about my rankings this time. I've platinum this game. I don't care about my ranking, so. Nope, 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 nope. Keep pressing the wrong button. Alright, there's the other one. I thought there was a way to open this door. Huh, I guess it wouldn't let me open it until I got the uh, little key. That is nasty. That is nasty. Do I have room? <laughs> no. Actually, Ow! get off me, you fucking bitches. No. Here we go. I think this leads, yeah, that leads back to this room. Which, I might as well just go in there. Ow! Oh! 
Jesus Christ. She's gonna be back to danger again. Take this. What else did I miss in here? Ink ribbon. We'll just take it. Jesus. I, I don't even know how you're supposed to avoid those. You really can't. Let's go. Yeah. All right. Let's uh, switch around some items here. I'll go. Okay. Come on. Yeah. That's ridiculous. She's on caution, just from those stupid frickin' leeches. What are you shooting at? Ow! Shoot him! Ah! God damn it, she's on orange again. <laughs> Oh, that was pure luck. I'll check it out. Roger. Okay. This way. Ooh, that was close. Go back in here. Take those. God, you're gonna need them already. Exchange it. There we go. We got a blue key card for uh, Jimmy Lewis. So, yeah. Jimmy Lewis. Let's go. Let's go, Billy. I do have the right card. This is Delta Team. We have gained control of the train. Over. Understood. This does not make any sense. How was the T-Virus leaked? And why did it contaminate both the lab and the mansion, as well as a train almost three miles away? That's irrelevant. We must make sure no knowledge of this gets out. Destroy the train. Completely. How far away are you from the nearest branch line? About ten minutes, to. Huh? What happened? That was Wesker and William Birkin. How cool. Train is completely pick is quickly picking up speed. I 
think it's a bad idea for me to have these ori these original controls or new controls on. I should have had the original on because I think it's gonna frick me up in the end. The train line, the derailer crash. I gotta stop this thing. Brake operation manual. Using the brake control, the following three steps are necessary to operate the brakes. Activating the controls, brake controls are located in the following locations. First car driver's compartment, rear deck of the fifth car. To activate the system, you must insert the magnetic card into the device in the fifth car. This will supply both power to both sets of controls. Step two, rear deck code. Enter the code for the rear deck unit to release the lock. After this, the driver's compartment code can be entered. Step three, enter the driver's compartment code. Okay. Who will stay behind? Rebecca. I'll go over to the back deck and manipulate the control panel for the brake. Then you apply the brake from here, okay? All right. Billy. What? Be careful. Yeah. I need to take this with us. Oh shit, do I not have any room? Take that with us as well. And there's some underneath that little thing over there, so. Sure, pick those up as well. I'm on a time limit, I know. Okay. But we're gonna take a little shortcut. gonna take a little detour to avoid pretty much all the fighting. There's no zombies or anything up here. There's leeches, but you don't have to fight like six zombies on your way to the fifth car, so this is always the safer way to go. There's a stupid leech on my back. Okay, I lied. But, you still miss three zombies, so you can just run past this guy after you shoot him down once. Eduardo, or whatever his name is. Nope. Okay, see? These controls are already fucking me up. I should not have used these controls. I wonder if I can change them in the options. We'll see. We shall see. Some trick to get there. That's what he had to do. Billy, I've engaged the control device for the brake. Over. Roger. I'll put the brake on now. All right. Now this one. It's thirty-six. Okay. Four, eight, twelve, sixteen, 
20, 24, 30, 32, 34, 36. Got it! It's actually a really easy Oh, that was wrong? Did I not count right? 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32, 34, 36. Oh, I counted wrong. Oh my god, he's gonna die. Okay, he's not gonna die. Just get the fuck- why did you stay there and shoot them? Grab this. No, I don't need that. No, I didn't want to use it. Let's just get out of here. Ah! That was Billy's own fault. He was the one that stayed there and started shooting him. But anyway, all the items that you examined and left in the train were all outside the train there. Sewage- the sewage water gives off a stench so bad it makes your eyes water. That's gross. The Umbrella Research Center? General Manager, Dr. James Marcus. Who on earth are those people? She's just a rookie, a member of STARS. Hmm, what about the male? I'm unfamiliar with Attention! Mm -hmm. This is Dr. Marcus. Please be silent as we reflect upon our company motto. Obedience breeds discipline. Discipline breeds unity. Unity breeds power. Power is life. <laughs> who are you? <laughs> it was I who scattered the T-virus in the mansion. Needless to say, I contaminated the train, too. What? Revenge. On Umbrella. Oh! I never knew that. So he was the one that spread it everywhere. <laughs> 
Ten years ago, Dr. Marcus was murdered by Umbrella. You helped them, didn't you? <laughs> All right. Well. Who in the world has the ink ribbons? I think I dropped them and I never picked them back up, but that's okay. We're gonna save the game here. I don't want to carry that. All right, guys. That's gonna be the end of this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um... We got through the whole train. Uh, that part's really not too difficult, although I did struggle a little bit. Uh, I already used a first aid spray and some herbs, so... Well, anyway. Um, so, if you guys enjoyed, please smash the like button down below, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Bye!